Should beginners avoid using AI to code? Well, let's say you've just started learning to code. You're fresh-faced, bright-eyed, and slightly terrified of semicolon. Now, imagine giving a lightsaber to someone who's only just learned how to hold a stick. That's essentially what handing AI coding tools to a beginner is. Sure, it's shiny. Sure, it makes cool noises. But before you know it, you've chopped off your own arm and your own logic. Now, I'm not saying you shouldn't use AI at all, just that you should treat it like a tutor, not a butler. Ask it questions like, why does my code cry itself to sleep at night? Or what exactly is a callback and why does it sound like something my ex never gave me? That way, you're learning, you're engaging, you're building actual skills. But if you're just copy pasting AI generated code, like it's a Buzzfeed recipe, you're not really coding. You're just playing the world's most over-engineered game of Mad Libs. Sure, you get something that compiles, but do you understand it? Could you rewrite it? Could you fix it? Could you explain it without sounding like a contestant on University Challenge who's just buzzed in too early? Look, if you're building a throwaway app, a one-off script, or you've got 10 minutes before your manager finds out that you've broken production again, then fine, fire up the AI and get it done. But if your goal is to actually learn how to code, then let AI do it for you is like learning to drive by hiring a chauffeur. You'll arrive, yes, but you've got no idea how you got there or how to reverse. So use AI, but use it wisely as a guide, as a mentor, as the friendly wizard who nudges you along the road, but still lets you do the dragon slaying. Because if you skip the hard stuff now, one day you'll find yourself debugging AI generated code that you don't understand and realizing tragically that the dragon was you all along. More of this from the nerdiest people you know at craigandave.org.